Well, to be honest with you, uh, I promised myself, I dropped out of college, mm. out of university to get married when I was mm. young. Mm. And I always promised myself after my first child was born mm. that I would go back and finish. Right. But then there was two and then three and four, five, six. <laughs> <laughs> they came one after the other until <coughs> there were 11. But as soon as that 11th one uh, turned four years old, I mm. said, I'm going to do what I promised myself. Right. So I went to get my bachelor's degree at 48. Mm. And then at 50, I'm thinking, what's next? Uh, right. And it w I'm a runner. So every morning mm. I'm, I'm running, mm -hmm. you know, three to five kilometers. And it really came to me on this morning run in mm. January of 2012 mm -hmm. that I should get my master's at Harvard. Mm. And right. sometimes, you know, God has uh, divine plans for us. Mm. And when they come in our heart, it's mm. difficult to shake it. You can't let it go. Mm. And even if you try to bury it, mm. it just keeps popping back up. Right. And often those messages are I think impossible dreams. Hmm. Impossible for me because I had seven children still at home. Hmm. Uh, I didn't have the money to go there. Mm -hmm. I didn't have the prestigious background in my right. mind. And uh, fourth, it was uh, over 2,000 kilometers just one way. Hmm. You know, how, how do you do that? But I did visit the campus hmm. and met with the dean. Hmm. And the dean was a woman. Right. And I told her all the reasons why I couldn't do Harvard. Hmm. And she said, you will find a way. You right. will find a way to fly here every single week hmm. and you will get this degree hmm. because this master's degree will change your life. Right. And it was, you know, it's teachers like you, mentors that come hmm. in our life hmm. just when we're going to quit, <laughs> that pat us on the back and say, you can do it. Hmm. And I ended up receiving a scholarship right. that paid for my airfare every week for three hmm. and a half years, That's my good. tuition, hmm. my books, one night hotel, because I'd fly in one day. Hmm eight hours flight, mm. <laughs> <laughs> take all my classes, mm. and fly back early the next Here morning. Because I was working full time and mm. raising the children. And so it was just a matter of time management at that point. Mm. And ended up uh, graduating in 2016 mm. with my master's in international relations, mm. with all of my uh, research on NASA mm. and our US space program. That's great.